Mm. Love that anthropology candle, but hate the price tag? Me too. That's why I scoured the internet to find you a candle duplicate that I think will exceed all your expectations, but not your budget. Coming up. Hey friends, welcome to Adulting with Esther, the show where we talk about the things that you don't learn in school. And today, we're gonna be mixing it up a little bit. I'm going to be sharing with you a product that I think is going to blow your mind. It's a duplicate of the anthropology candle that we all know and love as the Capri Blue Volcano Candle. If you're new to this channel, welcome. Consider hitting the subscribe button down below and make sure you take a moment to check out the description where I've got links in there for the products I mentioned in this video as well as a discount code for you. Oh, and make sure you stick around to the end of the video where I'll be sharing with you proper candle care so that you can get the best value out of your candle. So let's get started. This is the candle duplicate that we'll be comparing to today from Clarksville Candle Company, the Volcano Type Candle. To start out this review, I want to give a quick testimonial of my experience with these candles. My husband and I recently listed our condo for sale. We were prepared for it to be a long and difficult sale because we had a lot of factors against us. We're a garden unit, we're only 700 square feet, one bedroom and one bath, and we live about 10 miles from downtown, which can be a 30 minute Uber or an hour long train ride. And when we bought this place, we got a huge discount on it because the owner was desperate to get it sold and it had been on the market for about four or five months. So what happened to us? Our very first showing lasted 30 minutes. Our place is really tiny. The woman didn't wanna leave because she loved the atmosphere of our home. And we had these candles in every single room. We ended up receiving our first offer within six days of listing. And they actually wrote the offer like right outside our window. And our small apartment actually went under contract after two weeks of listing it. The guy who had lived here before us did a great job of staging it, but the thing he didn't pay attention to was the scent. The offer we accepted for our place was 100% cash and about 10 grand over the comparable market value. And I have to believe it's because of these guys. So let's dive into the nitty gritty. The Anthropology Capri Blue Volcano Candle smells like you're walking into a Hawaiian tropical oasis filled with plumeria flowers and delicious tropical fruit. And Anthropology says that their key scents are tropical fruits, sugared oranges, lemons and limes, and lightly exotic mountain greens. The Clarksville Candle Company Volcano Type Candle smells almost exactly the same, only a little bit more fruity. They describe this candle as having a tropical foliage scent with a fruity heart. Its scents are pineapple, goji berry, mango, with a hint of driftwood. And Karen is very explicit when she says that this candle was inspired by the Capri Blue Volcano Candle from Anthropology. And I think they did a great job. But now I have a question for you. What's your favorite candle scent? Let me know down in the comments. Let's talk containers and sizes. When you purchase the Anthropology candle, it's clear you pay the premium for the container. This one is the more basic of their models and it runs $30 for the 19 ounce variety. And through Anthropology, if you're willing to pay two or $50 more, they have a variety of other containers and sizes available to you. So if you're on a budget, you could get their eight ounce candle for $16 in a metal tin. For Clarksville Candle Company, they do only have two types of containers. Though, because it's Etsy, I'm sure if you were to make a personalized request, they'd be able to meet your needs for an alternative pricing, assuming that you don't like this container. Your two options are the 12 ounce variety, and they also have a six ounce variety, which is half this size. I prefer to buy the larger one simply because it's a better value, but we'll talk about prices in a minute. Oh, and if you're getting value out of this video so far, make sure you hit that like button. The other most important factor when you're buying candles is burn time. Their 19 ounce candle boasts a 58 hour burn time up to leads to how well you take care of your candles. And remember, if you hang around to the end, I'll tell you more about that. Do the math, you're getting about three hours of burn time for every ounce of candle. Whereas with Clarksville Candle Company, they've got a 19 ounce candle that boasts an up to 80 hour burn time, meaning that every ounce of wax will get you about six and a half hours of burn time. Are you seeing the value in this? You get double the burn time with these candles. Now let's talk about packaging. When you get your candles from Clarksville Candle Company, they'll come in a priority mailbox, varying sizes depending on how many you order. And they pack them well. Every time I've received an order from Karen, that's the owner, she sends a lovely little note which just adds that personal effect that you don't get out of chain store like Anthropology. Not to mention, look how great this is packed. We've got these natural water solvent peanuts. And not to mention, this candle is wrapped up so nicely. As a consumer, whenever I order something glass in the mail, I always wonder if it's gonna make it safely. Whenever I order things from Clarksville Candle Company, I'm always confident that they're going to arrive safe and secure. For the Anthropology candle, I did choose to buy it in person, so I'm not entirely sure how they package them when you buy them online. So when I got it in person, I got it in this cute bag, and here's my candle. Not too crazy. 
Okay, the moment you've all been waiting for, let's talk about some numbers. The best value you can find at Anthropology for this scented candle is the 19 ounce glass jar for $30. And if you're buying it online, it's an additional $6.95 for shipping unless you meet the minimum threshold for free shipping, which is $50. The best value from Clarksville Candle Company is their 12 ounce candle, which comes in at $12.95. Shipping with them is prorated based on the size of your purchase, meaning if you buy a small candle, it'll be about $5 shipping, and if you buy a lot, shipping will be more. But at Clarksville Candle Company, their free shipping threshold is a lot lower. It's actually only $35. Oh, and did I forget to mention, I got you guys a discount code. It's Esther10. Just type that in when you're buying it and you'll get 10% off. I don't have a code for anthropology. Sorry. Are you seeing the value here? Clarksville Candle Company's candles cost less, they burn longer, they smell stronger, and they give you free shipping quicker. Not to mention, they have a wonderful consumer experience. So maybe you're a person who chooses to not have an open flame in your home. Clarksville Candle Company also offers the wax melts. These come in at $4.95 for a pack, and you can throw them into any sort of wax melt container. Anthropology actually doesn't even offer wax melts, but they do have a diffuser, essential oil, as well as a spray that you could spray around your room. What I've been doing with these is I just break them up and put them in little places around my house and they are scented so strongly that I don't even have to heat them up. But once they start to dissipate with their scent a little bit, then I might heat them. And so maybe you're not a fan of this volcano type candle, but you're willing to explore their other scents and you wanna know if they're good or not. In one of my orders, Karen threw in a free peach wax melt for me, which talk about the customer experience. When was the last time you got a free gift from Anthropology? Never. I can barely get a 10% discount. And I showed these to my husband <laughs> and he said, wow, that actually smells like real peaches. And it does. I hope what you're getting here is that their candles are scented strongly and they have a good burn time. If you're looking for candles that give you a good value, which is a good smell for a long time, I highly encourage you to check out Clarksville Candle Company. Use my discount code so you can get 10% off. Spend the 35 bucks so you can get the free shipping. Make your home smell good so that it can sell fast like mine did. So now let's talk about how to take care of your candles so you can make them last as long as possible. The first time you light your candle, make sure you're going to be able to leave it lit for an hour or two. Candles and wax have what we call a memory. And the memory you want it to have is that it's okay to burn the wax all the way around the edge. If your wax pool is only half the distance, what you're gonna have happen is a candle that burns all the way down to the bottom, leaving that fresh wax around the edge. And then you'll be Googling how to use up a candle when the wick is gone. Every time that you light your candle, including the first time, you need to trim down your wick to a quarter of an inch to a half of an inch. First thing I'll prevent is that nasty black edge around the top of your candle that looks all smoky and gross. The second thing it'll do is prevent contamination of your wax. You know, when the wick gets really big and then it drops off into the wax and then your wax has ugly black chunks in it and it just doesn't look pretty anymore. So just remember, always trim your candle before you light it. When you light your candle, make sure that it's on a level surface. That'll allow the wax to melt evenly across the top and again, get a longer burn life. You also wanna hold on to your lid. Put it on whenever you're not using it, AKA when you leave the house and when you go to bed. I like to leave the lid off of mine throughout the day just because it smells so good. I have one in each room and I don't even need to light mine most of the time and it's still smells awesome. But if I have friends coming over, that's when I light them and kind of oofs the experience a little bit. Putting the lid on your candle will one, make the scent last longer because it's gonna contain it in the glass container. And two, it'll keep any dust or dander or hair out of your candle. And dust, dander, and hair don't smell sexy when they burn. So protect your candle and make it smell good. And the last part of candle care is safety. It's recommended that for with candles, you don't burn them for more than four hours. And you'll notice if you do that, it turns into all liquid wax. And if you bump it, which I have, wax gets everywhere and it's a pain in the butt to clean up. You also are not supposed to burn it past a quarter of an inch at the bottom. That's because the wick will get down into the metal part and get all sparky and yeah, it's just not good. And you should make sure that you always keep this on a heat safe surface as the glass can heat up and you don't want it to start a fire. But remember, if you're afraid of having fire in your house, check out the wax melt options. So clearly, I'm in love with the Clarksville Candle Company Volcano Type Candle. Make sure you check the description down below for a link to the Clarksville Candle Company Etsy shop, as well as a 10% off discount code that you can use so you can get more delicious candles and make your house smell good. If you try their other scents, let me know how they smell. And don't forget our question of the day. What flavor and scents of candles do you prefer? Let me know down in the comments. Friends, if you got value out of this video, don't forget to hit that like button and make sure you subscribe down below so you can get alerted when we post our next video. Stay awesome. Stay you, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.